Mediation efforts will continue despite the end of truce, Qatar has announced. Doha has called for an international probe into Israeli war crimes in Gaza. And finally, Israel's security chief has vowed to kill every Hamas leader in different countries around the world. Hi, this is Ali, this is The Roundup, and here are today's top stories. Qatar's Ministry of Foreign Affairs has announced that mediation efforts between all parties is still set to continue despite the truce coming to an official end. The ministry added that Israel's continued bombing complicates the mediation efforts and piles on the human catastrophe in the Gaza Strip. The first truce was active for 10 days after the Gulf states successfully negotiated a ceasefire between Israel and Hamas, which saw captives released on both sides. On that note, Qatar's Prime Minister and Foreign Minister Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdurrahman Al Thani has called for an international probe into Israeli war crimes in the besieged Strip. The ending of the truce on Friday has seen Israel continue its relentless bombing with over 700 Palestinians killed in the last 24 hours. Sheikh Mohammed said Qatar is looking towards facilitating another truce and reaching a permanent ceasefire. And finally, Israeli Shin Bet chief Ronan Barr has announced that Israel has plans to assassinate Hamas leaders around the world, including Lebanon, Turkey, and Qatar. This was revealed in recordings released to Israeli media on Sunday. Hamas leaders have brushed off the Israeli threats, saying the action would be an international law violation. Well, that's all for today. For more stories, head over to our website website or download our app.